Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. Today we are playing Five Nights at Maggie's. I don't really have anything to say, so let's just get right into it. I've already played the first night, but I'll play it again just for YouTube purposes. Just see what it was all about. Maggie's Magical World. I think it's just like Five Nights at Freddy's little more animatronic, so... I'll turn the volume up so you guys can hear. Hey, welcome to your job. Uh, I'm recording these tapes to help you get settled on your first night. I'm guessing you'll be replacing me after I quit this job in about a week. I'm gonna warn you, this place is a nightmare. I don't really like it here, but, well, money is money, I guess. Uh, anyway, let's start with this. So, as you can see, you have a computer in front of you with the camera system. To change the cameras, just use the numbers on your keyboard. Behind you, you have the main hallway and a security door. To close it, just hold the button, and then under the desk, you have the vent system. I will explain later why you need to use that. Uh, now, there are a lot of things happening in this place at night, mainly involving the, uh, animatronic characters. You see, they tend to move for some reason. I asked a company about it, and they just told me it has something to do with their security systems malfunctioning. I, I don't really know, and I don't really believe that either. You might have already heard the stories and stuff from this place. Uh, a lot of people saying the spirit of the owner is haunting the place because... Well, he died here. Um, guessing you know all of this, or at least I'm, uh, I hope. Uh, anyway, uh, going back to the animatronics, there are five of them on the stage. You know, Maggie, Chanchi, Lola, Hank, and Flower. And then there's that other one in Parts and Services, but we'll talk about him later. So let's start with Maggie and Lola, you know, the yellow cat and the orange dog. So, they'll try to go to your office, and they'll try to get in through the hallway behind you. When you see them close to you, just close the door, and they'll eventually go away. Um, now, for Chanchi the pig, you'll see him staring right at the camera. Whenever you see him, just change the camera really fast, and you'll, you'll be okay. If you don't change it fast enough, though, he will start running towards you. Uh, if the camera stopped working after you saw him then just turn around if you can. Um, that should be all for tonight. You don't have to worry about the others yet. Well, uh, see ya, and good luck. For a fun game, well, for a more world game, that is, that isn't exactly a fun game. It is really quite a hard quality game. It seems like a really good game. So I'm just going to play through night one in this video, but if you do happen to like this video, Give it a like and I'll play nights one, two, and three in, in the next video. Or I might play night two in this one, I don't know. I'll decide on how long this video actually is. But I'll, um, I'll get back to you once something happens. While we're waiting for something to happen, I would like to ask you a question. If you guys have seen this video and have. Oh. Anyway, if you guys have any suggestions for Gothel Horror Games or any kind of mobile game to play, Please put it down in the comments and I will probably get to it and play it. Anyway, dog seems to have moved. Just gotta watch him now because apparently he'll be in here in this hallway. Okay, he is in the hallway. Yeah, I've just got to keep an eye on these two. I think it's going to go the door, shut the door, wait a couple of seconds and he should go. No, he's on the camera. I've just got to watch this thing now. Probably don't move. The pig keeps coming up on the screen, as you can see. I'll make sure. 
Okay, good. Well, not me. Uh, I got to change the camera quickly. I can change it quickly. Just stay with me. In case you know, I don't get jump scared on the first night, because that would be quite bad. We're at 5 a.m. as you can see. Don't let both of you get into the hallway. That'd be bad. She's not moving from the hallway, she's just staying at the bottom. So hopefully there's something that goes back. So I'm literally just flipping through both of you and put that in the corner to die. Hopefully that she doesn't jump scare me through there. Come on, 6am. Okay, not one. I think at the end I didn't change the camera in time because I had music like someone was running. What's this? I can't remember this. There's an animatronic. And the light shining in. Oh, it's the line. Who was that? I wonder who that was, guys. All right, this seems like a this seems like a perfect place to end the first video. If you guys do hope, and I hope you do enjoy. If you guys enjoy, like the video, and I'll get a part two out as soon as I can. Anyway, I I'd like to thank you for watching, and I'll see you all later. Goodbye.